Hello and welcome to a brand new series, Garen Reaver vs. Pokemon Colosseum. I love this game. So you might recall that I promised that I would do another Pokemon game and that I'd already decided what it was. It was Pokemon Colosseum. This is one of my favourite Pokemon games, easily in the top five. Maybe the top three? I'm not entirely sure on that. I thought it's been a while since I've done a Garin Reaver Versus, and I love this game, and I did promise another Pokemon game, so Pokemon Colosseum. I'm playing this on an emulator that I will not be naming, so please don't ask, and I'm playing it with a uh, controller. I am, of course, Garin. Yes, Garen is fine. So hopefully, th Skarmory! So hopefully this runs well. Uh, I had a bit of issue with lag in some of my early testing, but it doesn't appear to be laggy at the moment. It's such an evil smile. Good old Umbry on there. And Espeon waiting in the car. I absolutely love that you have Espeon and Umbry on in this. Although that guy's a massive prick. Scammery! Oh, that went well. And we're in the game. That's how quickly the game starts. And you start off at the outskirts stand, a lonely gasoline stand in a desolate desert. Travelers visit it on their journeys. So, this is a poor, sorry, an emulation of the old GameCube game, and I played it a lot on GameCube. Probably, this is probably my fourth or fifth playthrough of Colosseum. So, if you're unaware, you start off with an Espeon and an Umbreon, and I'm just going to switch their places, I just prefer Espeon being at the top. And when I was reading about this, um, apparently a lot of people don't keep Espeon and Umbreon in their team, and to me that's just sacrilege. And sadly, you can't rename them, but um, I have come up with names for them. And uh, I love that it says Garen's old friend. But yes, they are Dawn and Dusk. So, uh, any items? Maybe... Oh yeah, wow, I was going to say maybe a potion. So unlike other Pokemon games, this starts off rather immediate as res, you know, with two level 25 Pokemon. Wah, we just picked out, eh? I love chowing down after a job. It adds to the flavor, I swear. <laughs> yeah, and we bagged ourselves a great big catch, too. Boss will be sure to fix us up good with big rewards, too. <laughs> it doesn't get any better than this. He's got boobs on his head. They very nearly ran me over there. Oh. The animations in this aren't great, you know, it's, it's for the GameCube, so uh, it's very old at this point. But, oh, so much nostalgia, which is just going to hit me in waves as we go. Authorities have made a stunning announcement on the mysterious building that exploded in Eclo Canyon. In Eclo Canyon, it was Team Snagum's hideout. Team Snagum is a gang of Pokemon abductors who have already been marked for arrest. The hideout was discovered only as a result of the explosion. By the time police arrived, the ruined building had already been abandoned. Because the explosion is under investigation, it should become apparent eventually. I mean, who really cares, right? Hello. 
Hey, do you know about Team Snagum? Uh, t no. No, I know nothing about Team Snagum. They're a bunch of heartless crooks. They rip off Pokemon from trainers without any hesitation. I hear they use something called a Snag Ball to catch Pokemon from their rifle trainer in battle. I'm guessing that you're a trainer. You best be careful. Oh yeah, yeah, I wouldn't want, uh... Wouldn't want to meet anyone from Team Snagum. Oh, I haven't seen your face around these parts. A traveller, huh? Not that it matters any. I don't know where you might have come from, but relax, stick around a while. There's no forgiving that Team Snagum. They don't deserve it, not when they steal Pokemon from trainers. Why, I'd give a hip hop hooray. Hip, oh, hip, hip hop hooray. <laughs> hip hop hooray. <sighs> Very jaunty song. If they were wiped out with their wretched hideout. Wrecked hideout. Sorry, I'm having trouble reading today. You know, I don't quite understand what happened, but having your hideout blow up on you, crime doesn't pay, I guess. I live a crime-free life, so nothing's going to blow up on me. <laughs> Especially not my wife. What? Hmm? Hello, Mr. Pink Hair. You're a Pokemon trainer too, aren't you? Uh, yes. Huh, I can tell. And you're good. I can see it in your eyes. Are you flirting with me? I bet your Pokemon are impressive too. Is that a euphemism? If the opportunity ever arises, I'd like to battle with you. Though I doubt I'd have any chance of beating you. Yeah, he was definitely flirting with me. I love the aesthetic of this game. Look at this. They don't need to have a giant turning cogwheel in a diner, but it just it just makes the place feel a lot more, I don't know, unique. Uh, yo, wait, wait up. Oh, it's him again. Hey, my name's Willie. Of course it is. Of course it is. After I got a good look at you, well, I got this urge to battle you. It's like I'm compelled to... Anyway, I look at it, it's obvious you're no ordinary Joe. No, it's Garen. So what do you say? Let's you and me have a quickie. What? A battle? A, a quick battle? Sure. Yeah, that's the spirit. Alright, alright, over here this way. Oh, yeah. He's a bit too into it, isn't he? Yeah, I'm burning, I'm on fire, I'm so hot right now. It's full throttle time. Vroom, vroom, let's roll. Strange people. Ryder. Of course he is. Uh, so, every single battle in this game is a double battle. I love it. Because it means you can just use your Espeon and Umbreon straight away. Uh, also, I'll mention it now. Uh, although there aren't any wild Pokemon in this, you can you do still get Pokemon through the course of the game and you can name them. So, as always, uh, come up with suggestions. If you... I mean, it's a bit harder with this one because it's not like suggests Pokemon that can be caught. Sorry, I should probably be battling. It's not like suggests Pokemon that can be caught. Um, if you want, you can look up a list of the Pokemon that you can get uh, in Colosseum and let me know any name suggestions you have. Just like with Emerald, uh, I'm open to any suggestions. Doesn't mean I'll use them. Uh, and if they're going to be in my team, then um, I will come up with the nickname myself. So right there you can see that Espeon is so much more powerful than, than Umbreon. Espeon is a massive glass cannon in this. And screw it, bite. So there aren't all um, TMs and stuff, but you can get some TMs through the course of the game. It's a bit trickier because, like, I know, because I always plan these things. I planned the move set for Espeon and Umbreon, but not the others because I don't know exactly what is and isn't in this. And I could look it up, but you know, there's a load of faff on it. I just can't be bothered. I'll just, I'll go. I'll, I'll see as I go. Easy. But yeah, you're tough, real tough. You did a real number on us. Oh, God, my ass is so sore. I'm sorry, hmm? Hey, I know. Why not test your skills in Fennec City? It's out west of here. You'll find trainers who are way better than me there. You should go out there and get some battling in and then come back and show me. What? You're an odd fellow. I'm going to leave now. Bye-bye. And then... 
you just leave and there you can go to Phoenix City, a gorgeous jewel of a town that overflows with water in a forbidding desert. I love the design of Phoenix City. And look, I just love that they ride in the side, they're so cute. Look at it, it's so pretty. I would love to live there. I like water. Oh goody, it's uh, Titted. Uh, hey, what are you doing? Get a grip, man. Yeah, you say that, but this, it won't stop squirming. Makes it tough to hold on. God, it's everything sexual in this game. Okay, okay, settle it down in there. Just be quiet for a little while longer. I want some food and help. Somebody let me out, kidnappers. That tape didn't keep her yap shut. Hey, quit your shouting. Oh, Drat, did that punk over there hear all that? Just drop the body. Sup. Since you overheard us, we don't have any choice. Blame it on your own bad luck. Shady Guy Folly. The names are a bit odd in this. Forgot about that. Uh, this is set in Gen 3, in case you're unaware. Espeon. Dawn, sorry, and Dusk. Let's try Secret Power. So, Confusion. Boom. Knockout. Because Dawn is a bloody powerhouse. I think they're both male, actually, but yeah. Yeah, they are. Damn. <laughs> That's fine. I mean, Dawn and Dusk sound... Uh, Dusk, I suppose, is a, is a um, male-sounding name, but Dawn is a very female-sounding name. Wismer's tail's odd looking. You know what I didn't realise until I played this game? That Wismer has little holes in his head. I didn't actually see what Secret Power did. I suppose it did a fair bit of damage. But that's fine. Just annihilated anyway. Boom. Level up. Espeon is slightly high level. Damn, I should have checked the stats. Espeon, uh, Umbreon is slightly higher level. Go, you're tougher than you look. Forgot his voice again. You took out my Wisma. You're no ordinary trainer, are you? Huh? Wait a sec. That face. Might you be Team Snagums? And everyone moves in for the kill. What? What? What's going on out here? Eek, somebody. Robbers, they're robbers. You be quiet. We're no robbers. We're kidnappers. Get it? Kidnappers. What? You dingbat. Don't shout off your, shoot off your mouth. Don't get all happy just on account of winning this once. I shall have won twice. I'm undefeated. The next time we meet, I'll trash you, your Pokemon and all. And they're gone. Oh, yuck. There's somebody in there. Let's just chuck him in the water and have done. Yeah, oh, this is tied good and tight. Can you believe those people? What a horrible thing to do. Kidnapping. God, what wankers. They left their truck. Their hover truck. Oh. Please, we need your help. No, you don't. Please, we need your help. You really don't. I, you've got this, seriously. I'm just going to go home. Please. Ugh. Fine, fine, fine. What? The sack's mouth is firmly closed with a tightly knotted rope. Look, I tug hard on the knotted rope. Look, you just pull it. You just pull it. There. Oh. Well, hello. Phew, thank goodness I'm saved. Wh where is this? Where did those two bring me? This is Fennec City. Wow, those two sound very similar, don't they? The opulent city of water. This person saved you from those thugs. Uh, Hi. The way he battled those goons, it was truly superb. I wish you could have seen, but of course you were in a sack on the floor. Oh, is that so? Thank you. And, uh, you are... Um, Garen. Oh, so you're named Garen. Well, yeah, I literally, that's the only thing I said. I am... Ooh. I forgot you could name her. Um... I think last time I played I called her Misty, because, you know... Red hair, pigtails, and I was unimaginative. I'm going to go with Rui. I like it. 
I think his na default name is Wes or something. My name's Rui. I'm sure glad I met you. I was in the neighbouring town when those two grabbed me. Oh, those guys. D they use a peculiar Pokemon? A peculiar Pokemon? No, they looked ordinary to me. What do you mean by peculiar Pokemon? Hmm? Oh, no, that's, no, that's perfectly fine then. Don't worry. Well, it's easy to see something's on your mind. You should go see our mayor for his advice. He's a very kindly person. I'm sure he'll be able to help you somehow. The mayor's house is n near the Fountain Square past here. Go up the stairs from the square and it's on your left. The mayor? Yes, that's true. The mayor might know something. Hey, Garen, I know I'm imposing. Yes, you are. But I don't have anyone else I can turn to. Please, can I get you to escort me for a while? No. Oh, but those men might come back. Please, can I get you to stick with me for a little while? No. Oh, but those men might come back. Please, can I get... Fine! My God! Thank you, Garen. <laughs> I thought you might say that. I did try to say no. If you're with me, Garen, it won't matter if those guys come back again. Thank you. Thank you for joining me for a while. Technically, you're joining me. I go where I want and you follow me. Just, just let's get that straight. 